definitely had like 10 people look at me from the street right there. That's what I like though. <laughs> in my apartment in Westwood when I first moved to Los Angeles, I would always go out onto the balcony and scream something inspirational. Like good morning Los Angeles. Like good morning Los Angeles. And usually I got a couple of responses, you know. Listen, what's going on here? You gotta wake up. It's your last day in Paris. You can't joke around. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, folks. Yeah. Welcome to another episode. Yeah, this is my phone, right? I know it's your phone. Doesn't matter. I'll airdrop it to myself. Look at this super French window we're working with here. Madison's our last day in Paris. Yes. We're off to London tonight. And we have a 12 freaking hour layover. So we're gonna stay in the hotel. Look at my hair. That's some hair right there. Today, we have to go buy a duffel bag because we bought too many clothes while we're here in France. So we're gonna buy a bag and then probably some more shoes, honestly. Um, and then some breakfast mats or no? Are we gonna eat? No. No breakfast because we just have eaten ourselves to death here in Paris. I have a one pack at this point. All this gotta go. All this gotta go. We're staying in an Airbnb, and I was all excited to go out and attack the day, but remembered we have to clean the whole freaking place. Uh, so let's do that. Look at that. Squeaky, squeakity, squeakity clean. It's funny because it was kind of like a snap of my fingers because I went out to do some errands, and the young Madison cleaned. <laughs> Thanks, Madison. <laughs> Here we are guys, made it to London. Something's happened to my voice. I cannot undo it. I wanted to buy something right off of the airplane and uh, the lady asked me, she said, would you like to pay in US dollars uh, British pounds? And I, like a stupid American, said, whatever's cheaper, mate. <laughs> um, we have a 12 freaking hour layover in London. That's what you get when you pay cheap tickets. So we're headed to the hotel to spend the night. But we're thinking about just like staying up all night and doing a little fiesta. One more last hurrah before we get to the United States. So we'll see, we'll see about that. Run, forced. So I was looking up places to get dinner at because we landed, hey, excuse me. Madison, stop farting, okay. Um, so I was looking up places to eat and I was like, damn, I really want me some Chick-fil-A right now. So I looked it up on the maps, typed it in. The closest one is 3,900 miles away, so we're definitely not getting Chick-fil-A. Madison, are you putting on your story right now that Chick-fil-A is 3,950 miles away? Mm -hmm. So we don't really know what we're gonna do for dinner. We got some wine already, so step, done, step one is done. Now we're just waiting for the hotel shuttle and hopefully they have some like room service situation. But we shall see what dinner will be, my friends. You got me this time. How does it feel? It sucks to suck, doesn't it? Ow. <laughs> hey, you got a big old ring on that finger. You can't hit me with that. The hangers. Bus here. Bus, where is the bus? 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 Ow. Not only did that hurt me physically, but emotionally. Whoa. Are you wiping away my tears? This layover sort of blows because we landed at 9.30 p.m. and we have to take off, stop it. And we have to take off again at 9.30 a.m. So we basically have a 12 hour layover in the middle of the night and we're like 45 minutes from downtown London. Madison, if we had a layover in the middle of the day, we could go see the Big Bend and the Queen of England. We could go grab some tea with an, and crumpets. Your mom's a Your Dude. <laughs> you missed. Ah. <laughs> We're getting up. No, fuck. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, you know you're fucked when you can't work an iPhone. <laughs> Say it, woman. <laughs> We're getting our walking in a little bit later than we expected to. Yeah, well, you definitely are. So Maddie left me in charge of making sure that the bus was gonna pick us up and take us to the hotel. We were waiting at the bus stop and apparently shuttles come every 15 minutes and we were there for like 20 minutes and I was like, this seems a little suspicious. So we were waiting at the wrong terminal for like 20 minutes for the bus. I blame Maddie for putting me in charge because I'm not a responsible adult and I can't properly read. Well, I mean, it is written in uh, English or British, so I can't read it. <laughs> Same language, Mads, or no? Is British written? I think it's they spell things differently, so I couldn't well, read it. Baggage reclaim, not baggage claim. So. Oh, that, that's <laughs> that a whole other topic. Yeah, for baggage claim, they call it baggage, baggage reclaim, which actually makes a lot more sense to me. So yeah, now we have to figure out how to get to the proper terminal to get the shuttle to go to the hotel, and it's like almost midnight. It Sorry, can I get the door? Smells here? weird. It does smell weird. We did it! We made it to the hotel. Look at these, hotel. these look like real suitcases right here. Hotel, but they're not. Hotel, Holiday Inn. Hotel, Motel, Holiday Inn. Okay, so now we still have to go get dinner. I was about to plug my phone in to charge it because we're at 2%. And they have different outlets out here. So we, got a, we had a converter for France, but we don't have one for freaking wherever we are. <laughs> So fuck me, dude, and it's late. And I'm not gonna have a phone charged. How are we gonna do life? Oh how my are you gonna God. film your vlogs? Yeah, how am I gonna film my vlogs? Let's go eat. Dude, we're fucked. All right, let's... I'm about to freak the fuck out because the two restaurants, like, even close to our hotel, they are both very much closed. So I was making jokes about wine for dinner, but it's looking like it's wine for dinner. Madison is already very much committed to that idea. <laughs> Guys, I'm like, I don't even know, I don't even know what life's about right now. I don't have dinner to film. It's just, a, it's just a whole lot of, a whole lot of this. Thank you for watching the real one made it to the end um this may not be the end though i don't know because i might just film how's your dinner madison nutritious wine definitely has really bad macros so i don't know about the whole nutritious part um but we're off for another adventure tomorrow we're gonna try and figure out how to take the bus in the morning it's every 40 minutes so we definitely can't fuck it up i'm tempted to just wake up at 4 a.m well if our flight's at 9, though, like, we kind of have to be up at, like, what? Hold on, what time What time do these buses come? Terminal 2 and 3, journey every 20 minutes. We have to take it at 6.16, Madison. A.M. Or maybe at 7, actually. Hopefully the flight's at 9.30, so if it's at 9.30, then we can take it at 7. All right, thank you for watching. We're going to get to drinking this dinner <laughs> and then hopefully sleep pretty soon because... A lot going on tomorrow. Stay tuned. Good night. Yes! Madison, we've done it. The guy at the front desk was very nice. He's gonna make us a couple of chicken sandwiches. I told him ham was okay if he's out of chicken, whatever, whatever he's got, you know? So it's not wine for dinner. I really didn't want to give in to that. You know, we've been out here 45 days, no food, no water. <laughs> so wine was quite the find. And what do I have here? An adapter. So we can keep the vlogging going, my friends. Although we probably won't keep it going that long because I need to eat. I can't tell you how absolutely delicious this moment is. I haven't even tasted the sandwich yet and it's freaking delicious. We are gonna slam witches and then Pass the freak out. Good night for real this time. Thank you guys for watching. Um, the two of you that are watching. Um, we are going to bed.